But it's not long until attentions turn back to the business. It's May, and with peak season fast approaching, Steve and Jill are looking for the headline act that'll pull in the punters. We've heard about an entertainer who's uh, sort of newish in town, so we thought we'd go along and have a look, see if it's any good for the Mariners. They're on their way to see singer Paul Burnham. I heard we've got uh, quite a lot in tonight. But Paul isn't always called Paul. This is worth its weight in gold. It means I can turn up anywhere and put on, put on a show. It's like Judy Garland. When he's putting on a show, he goes by the name of Guapatini. And I've even got bum padding in. Give me a little pert bottom. Are you enjoying that? I can tell you're enjoying that. I don't know whether you call them drag queens or drag artists. I don't know what is the correct term for them, really. But we've heard a lot about him. Um, all good. I don't think there's anywhere in Fangarola that's actually putting um, this sort of show on. Come on, darling. We're here. Oh, it's me when you start being nice. <laughs> <laughs> Always nervous. Um, although this is, uh, I've got a nice loyal following here. Uh, I've been here for like two years now, but. Um, I want to do a good show for um, for our guests who are coming to hopefully book me for their venue. But I've got my mum and dad in as well. Please welcome on stage the gorgeous Guapatini! How <laughs> lovely to see you all. You all look absolutely gorgeous. I didn't even know Little did clothes. <laughs> If he wasn't enjoying himself enough already, Steve has been invited to the stage. Blazers and a short. That's a, that's a loving look you're rocking this evening. I love the 80s as well. <laughs> now, I would like you to just say something lovely, lovely to your wife. You are the love of my life, Jill. And I'd like you to take the credit cards and go crazy. <laughs> really good night. Really good night. I thoroughly enjoyed it. I always, it's always a good night here. I think uh, uh, Steve is going to say, book me for, for his venue, which is always good. More work. Thank you very much. What an entertainer that guy is. Yeah, he's definitely got a booking. If I have to fork up, I help my own pocket, you know. Yeah, we'll put a cover charge on and hopefully we'll cover that uh, and it'll only get better. Steve and Jill think they've finally found themselves a star to light up their bar. We need that guy behind us to yeah. make a success of Mariners on the Green. So they've put on extra attractions to try to lure in the holiday makers. Hello. How are you doing? All right. I'm fine. How are you? Nice, nice to see you. you. Are you excited? Yeah. Very. I'm nervous. <laughs> oh, yeah. I'm a little bit nervous. Tonight they've booked the Costa del Sol's hottest new act. If I've set those to like a pink and a bluey white, can you see? Paul Burnham will later transform into the glamorous Guapatini. This, £800 this cost. My favourite comment is when I have men come up to me with their wives and they say, well, I wasn't going to come and see a drag show. There's no way you're going to get me to come and see a drag show. But my God, you've changed my mind. I've had a great night. Now that's better than all the applause and all the laughter put together. Got goosebumps telling you that. To cover Guapatini's fee, they've pre-sold 50 tickets at five euros each. Keep your tickets on in case you're coming in and out. You've got your two. But a rush of punters without tickets at the door is causing a seating problem. Oh, you no, they... Yours is not ordered. No, because... Right, so what, what you will need to do is, obviously, you want to sit with them, you'll need yeah. to put another seat on that end of their table. They're on table six. 24, please. Oh, you're not right. I'm a bit annoyed yeah. now. Well, well, if nobody tells me, love, I'm not a mind reader, I'm sorry. Once the seating is sorted, the show can begin. <laughs> there was a musical composer in, in London, you may have heard of him, a little-known composer called Andy Lloyd Webber. <laughs> <laughs> kiss me, honey, honey, kiss me. Grab me, honey, honey, grab me. And Guapatini doesn't disappoint the crowd. It was something different. It was, it was it's... I'm not really into uh, drag artists, and I was really quite surprised how good it was. I thought he, she was very good. We want to get him in Barra. We think he'll go down very well. 
Tonight, Steve and Jill have taken 420 euros in ticket sales alone, more than covering Guapatini's fee. In addition to this, the bar took well over a thousand euros. Couldn't have asked for a better turnout. I've had more people just turn up on the night. And uh, yeah, a little bit stressful trying to sort them out, trying to sort tables out, trying to squeeze them in. Well, that's show business, isn't it? You know, and, and what a night. Couldn't have asked for anything better. Guapatini has helped make this the Mariners' best night yet. I've had lots of comments already about putting the fun back in Frangarola, putting the spirit back in Frangarola. You know, we, we expect it taking us two years to get established. I think, you know, if we carry on with these cabaret shows, it's going to make it. But it's still early days. Can the Mariners keep up the good work and continue to pull in the punters for the rest of the summer? And make the bar a permanent fixture in Fuenghirola.